Hi, hey, Chris and Linda. It's Mary. I'm over at the house on Weather Hill. This is coming in the front door. This is a really bright, nice, open plan. This is a big slider right there that goes out to the pool. Now, the backyard, from my estimation, looks like it's all pool. So you don't have much room to do anything else. But it's a big pool. Very nice. I'll go out, I'll step outside. Both these doors open, just like French doors to the outside. Kind of cool. If I go out here, you can see there's like a, looks like they had that set up for a dog run there. But then, so that's kind of cut off. And then all your pool equipment is right here. Looks like there's a gas hookup perhaps for a barbecue grill there, not sure. And then the pool, it's kind of glary. Hopefully you can see that. Very nice pool. It's just that there, there's not much else in the backyard. You've got your patio, of course, to sit on, but again, you don't have a lot to take care of that way. Okay, one second, and I'll shut this door behind me. Okay, so this is kind of looking back at the house, so the living room, there's the dining room over there, and then the kitchen opens up. So it's got this little eating area here, a little bit of a bar, not a whole lot. It's got granite countertops, it's granite tile, I believe. Stainless steel fridge. There's no stove or microwave in here. Granite backsplash as well. This is pretty nice over here. You've got a lot of cabinetry. All this, I'll back up a little bit. All this is cabinets, like pantry cabinets. And some of it, not all of it, that has some bins down there that are rollers you can pull out. This particular cabinet has all pullouts for the shelves, so you can roll those out, which is really nice. The ones on the sides don't have that. No dishwasher in this house. You see right there. No window treatments. It looks to me like when this house got foreclosed upon, that they came in and the company that owned it decided to clean it all up. The tile is very pretty. It looks like it's probably an 18 inch tile. I think it's ceramic, kind of a taupey color. I don't know how well you can see it. But that's the tile, it's very nice. Um, this back here, is just the hallway for, to the bedrooms, the other bedrooms, not the master. Um, nicely sized rooms, not huge, but not small, darker, brown kind of colored carpeting, but it looks in really good condition. One more bedroom back here. Both bedrooms have ceiling fans and lights. And then over here is the laundry room, which is just a room. Can't see much. See, so let me open that garage door. <clears throat> see if you can see. Oh, this is that third bay of the garage. There's a three-car garage here. So this is you, I mean, you could almost set that up as a room, but it does have a garage door. But a lot of people turn that into guest quarters. So you could do something like that, and that would be a really big room. Okay. <clears throat> I will walk on down the hallway, come back. There's the bathroom. Just a full bath. Single sink, cultured marble. <clears throat> There's a little pantry here. Walk-in pantry. And then on the other side of the house is the master bedroom. So again, it's a pretty good sized room. Here's the bathroom. They've taken the tile all the way up the walls. That looks very nice. Let's see if I can get you a better shot. Pedestal sinks, but there are two of them. And they have the lights that shine down on them. Garter tub. So there are no jets in that tub. And a walk-in shower. Um, I don't know about that shower. There's, <laughs> I don't quite know how you keep the water inside the shower. There's no wall around it. It's just like wide open, kind of odd. Um, and then this is the master closet. Can't see too much there. Just, you know, two sets of hangers and then a set of shelves in there. And then in the master bedroom, it's just a nice big size. And it's got um, 
crown molding up top. No window treatments again here because I think that company came in probably and redid it. My guess is they repainted everything. I, it almost looks to me like they put new carpet in. There's even little little pieces of car, carpet yarn on the floor. So it's brand new carpet and new paint. So it's in really good, definitely good moving condition. Just needs window treatments. So I guess that's it for this house. This is the one on Weather Hill.